Hi. Hello. Happy Monday. <laughs> Happy Monday to you. <laughs> I look awful with this hair, so let's just roll with it. I, I, I cannot remember the last time the vlog seen me with actually done hair. Well, you have had a shower after work. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Have you had a good day? <laughs> no, I'll rephrase that. How has your day been? Not the best, but it's all right now that I just get to sit and chill and enjoy. Yeah, a bit song. of a toughie today. Yeah. But you're playing... Uh, I'll show you. I'm playing... Resistance. Fall of Man. Um, I had this when... Oh my god, when did I first get my PS3? I got a PS3 Chunky, so the original one. They could still play PS1 games, that'll be a throwback. Wow. Um, back in 2000... Oh god... 2009, 2010. And um, I got that. I got that, Batman Arkham Knight, Arkham, 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 Arkham Asylum, and Ratchet and Clank Tools of Destruction. Yeah. And me being the foolish child that I was, Got rid of it, um, but being as though we've, this is a little taster for the game collection video, being as though we're obviously replacing some games, and obviously this is a PS3 exclusive, no, oh wait, nope, second drawdown, that was a little taster, uh, I decided to pick up the trilogy, so there's Resistance 1, Resistance 2, Resistance 3. So, I've never played the um, second one or the third one, so that'll be a fun thing. The only one that I haven't played any of them, which I've got two and three because you can only get one on the PS2, is Killzone, oh. which I'm really uh, upset about that it's not on the three. I know it's on like the digital store, which I might pick up, but yeah. So, yeah, today is the first day that my section of work has been back open um, at the dungeon. So I was in work today, which was lovely to be back. Um, yeah, really, really nice. Um, nice to be with everyone again and um, be performing, which is nice. Um, yeah, it was... I don't know, I was going to say something and then I completely forgot what it was. We found out today that um, the Hella Mega Tour that I was supposed to be going to with some friends had some extra tickets because it's been rescheduled again. It was supposed to be last year, got postponed to this year, has now been postponed to next year. So obviously people don't want their tickets anymore or they've had to resell them or whatever. So there's some more tickets that have come up. Um, so we managed to bag Dan one to come with us as well. Um, so that is now June 2022. Um, at some point I will get to see Green Day again. Um, but yeah, I think Dan's just going to finish up Resistance. I think we're going to go and watch some more of The Staircase because I only got five episodes in and we started watching it yesterday and um, together because Dan's not watched any of it. And um, yeah, we've properly got into it. So we're going to we're gonna go and watch a bit of that before before bed and then back at work tomorrow. I am so tired. So uh, shall we go my darling? Yeah. Hi guys, um, it is Friday. We have been really bad at vlogging this week um, basically because we've both been back at work. It's been super busy. Um, I've been trying to organise stuff for filming Good Grief and trying to balance having time off work, when obviously other people are going to ask for time off work as well because everything's starting to open up again so I'm just trying to figure out when I can actually have time off to do that and try and schedule that. Um, yeah, we've both been back at work this week. I have a day off from Alton Towers today but I actually am recording for my audiobook still. I'm going to the hairdressers in a bit which is why I've just slung my hair up because it's going to get cleaned and stuff later. And then I've got a self tip to do when I get home. So it's a day off from my day job, <laughs> but it's not a day off, not really. Um, I had a new eyeshadow palette, which I kind of ordered. I was trying not to buy any, new, any new makeup this year because I've got so many eyeshadow palettes already. But I bought this one as like a backup for work because I bought two new palettes, like small palettes, to put in my work makeup bag. But then two of the girls that I work with have got this palette, it's a Beauty Bay palette. 
um, that they've been doing some really cool makeup stuff with since we got back to work. So I bought this one and I thought, oh, it's got really nice colours and that I'll use anyway. But if I don't get on with the two smaller palettes, which arguably are easier to take to work because they're smaller, then I can take this big one. Um, so technically it's a work purchase. That's what I'm telling myself to justify it. That's okay, right? I think that's okay. Um, my teeth are looking really nice. It's in a, It's been a week now since I've been whitening them. Um, they're still not where I want them to be. For example, this one is being quite stubborn. Um, won't lift very well, but it will, it will get there. Um, so yeah, really, really excited. Loving my eye makeup. Um, my eyelashes as well. These are not fake. These are my actual eyelashes just with some mascara on. And it's because I've been using... Um, a few vlogs ago, I think I mentioned when I went to go and get my eyebrows tinted and waxed that I was using a like a serum on my brows and on my eyelashes. It has it's slowly starting to work on my brows. I think they're being a bit more stubborn, but it's definitely definitely working on my eyelashes. I mean, look like that's just like one coat of my mascara, which is insane. Um, so yeah, really sorry we've been crap with vlogging this week. Um, Monday and Tuesday we got home from work. I did a bit of recording and we I was I was just tired on Tuesday like I was so tired. And then Wednesday cinemas opened in Nottingham again. Well, our cinema that we go to in Nottingham opened again. So we went to see Spiral. It was it was a film. It had its good moments. Was it great overall? No, not really. Um yeah. Uh, Chris Rock wasn't bad in it. Um, yeah, it it was just a bit meh. It was just a bit meh. Um, but it was really nice being in the cinema. Last night, me and Dan took mum to see Godzilla vs Kong. And um, that was amazing. That was so good. Um, it was everything I wanted it to be. Um, yeah, it was great. Really, really, really enjoyed it. Really enjoyed it. Um... So definitely, definitely looking forward to when that gets released. We'll probably get the Blu-ray for that. So yeah, um, what have we got planned this weekend? Um, well, I'm working both the days. Dan's off on Sunday. And um, then, yeah, I think he's got a bit of work and bits and bobs to sort out on Sunday. So we'll see what cracks off. But yes, hopefully tonight and um, today while I'm out and then over the weekend, we will try and vlog a little bit more. It's just been... A really hectic week with us both getting back to work. So yeah, let's start recording and then go to the hairdressers. Let's start it with this. We've both had hairs cuts. We've both had haircuts, although mine's been under a wig cup all day, so it doesn't look great. Um, mine's been out in the rain, so that's <laughs> my excuse and I'm sticking with it. So, um, sorry <laughs> this week has not been the best for the vlog. We, um, we have wanted to talk, it's just de yeah. developments have occurred. So, um, basically the last time you would have seen me would have been on, what did I get my hair done? On Friday. Um, so Friday started by my car making a strange noise when I went to go to the hairdressers. My car then went to the garage. While I was at the hairdressers, I got a couple of phone calls off Dan, didn't think anything of it because I was in the hairdressers and I was like, oh, he's probably just telling me to, um, calling me to say he's on the way home from work. Um, so I just texted him and said, sorry, I can't talk. I'm still getting my hair finished. I then got a couple of phone calls from my mum and I was still getting my hair done. So I kind of just said, oh, I'll talk to you in a minute. Rang her when I was leaving the hairdressers and my mum scared the crap out of me by saying Dan's had an accident. Um, so... I'm not here. I'm dead. I'm a ghost. <laughs> Thankfully he wasn't hurt. That was my first question. I was in the middle of Nottingham City Centre and I did scream. Um, pretty loud. My mum said that Dan had had an accident. What actually happened, darling? Do you want to tell the vlog? Uh, obviously it's still an ongoing thing the minute um, but basically somebody just somebody decided to break check 
um, somebody a few cars ahead of me. Uh, they slammed on their brakes, I slammed on mine. Um, however, it was wet at the time, so skidded a little bit. The damage wasn't damage wasn't that bad to their car. To their car, ours was a little bit more, but not. Obviously, we'll let you know what happens. Yeah. But, yeah, we're just sort of dealing with that right now. So uh, we are currently a car down. Yes, I mean, we're not in the worst position. Like, thankfully, my um, mum was able to take me to work yesterday um, while my car was being looked at. And we think that all that happened was um, a stone got inside, like, the calipers. And it just, that's what the squeaky noise was. But it's worked its way loose. So it's fine. Um, so luckily we still have a car to be able to at least get to work because we live an hour away from work so without a car we'd be buggered um, we're hoping that the damage to Dan's car will be covered by his insurance and it won't be a write off but we're waiting for that to see what happens so sorry we've not been around much this week um it was a bit of a shock to the system being back at work, as I mentioned earlier in the week, but then the latter half of the week has just been, it's been quite crazy. So, um, yeah, please forgive us for not vlogging much um, this week. Um, and yeah, it's Sunday night. Um, I'm going to go and have a quick bath. Dan's going <sighs> to... Dan's had a day off today. So he's just been chilling, which I think he really needed after, you know, being in a car crash. Um, so, yeah, we're going to leave. We're going to leave the vlog here, I think. Although I will just say I'm very hormonal today. <laughs> and when I was cold at work all day today um, and in a lot of pain, all I could think about was the mac and cheese I was having for my tea and my sticky toffee pudding. And then when I actually cooked the sticky toffee pudding noticed how dark it was and obviously I'm not allowed to eat dark foods at the moment because I'm whitening my teeth and I had a proper hormonal breakdown to the point where I nearly cried because <laughs> it's all I wanted all day and um, Dan took me to Tesco's to uh, to buy me a different pudding because he's a good egg so yeah that, that's that been the nice end to the weekend <laughs> but yeah keep fingers crossed for us guys that the car gets fixed otherwise i think we're going to be spending our days off next week going car shopping so keep you all updated but yeah any last words my darling uh yeah if you're going to be a driver don't be an arsehole <laughs> yeah people who are bad drivers who get away with nothing and then people who just go to work and just try to do good in their lives, get absolutely buggered over by people. Who cause accidents who and then just drive off. Yeah, it's not on. I'm, uh, yeah. But yeah, tomorrow is the start of a new week, so. Let's hope it's all right. Yeah. We've, 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 we've gone through the crappiness. We need good news right now. Yeah. Right, we're going to wrap up. Yeah. We will see all you guys next week for uh, hopefully a bit more of a um, a vlog where we actually vlog. But yeah, Thanks. see you guys later. Thanks for, you know, understanding and shit. Cool. Bye.